Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to peep this out in this video. Carl's Jr. Teriyaki Burger Review. Peep this out. This is the new one that he uploaded yesterday, and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize, and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. So it looks like the peeps over at Carl's Jr. are looking to light up summer 2024 with little Hawaiian flair. And as you can wow. already tell, guys, I'm most definitely here for it. That's right, everyone. So sit tight, because up next, I've got their all-new teriyaki burger for you. As always, I'm Ian Kay, wow. and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. You know, I've never been to Hawaii, but I definitely want to go, guys. I mean, not just because of the scenery and how beautiful it is over there, but strictly because they've also got the dole plant on site right there as well, too, where they make oh all the my. pineapple goodness. Everything is done there. So a lovely situation. So this is kind of giving me shades of that because of what it looks like here with that grilled pineapple slice. Let me break this one on down for you fully from Carl's Jr. before we get right into it. Okay. So here we go with the teriyaki promo over here at wow. Carl's Jr., available wow. in a multitude of ways that we'll get into in just a second. But what I've got here, guys, starting us off is a toasted seated bun. And once we pop it and take a look underneath, you're going to notice plenty of teriyaki sauce. And that's right. looking to complement the grilled pineapple slice down below, as well as some melted Swiss cheese. And, guys, that's all on top of a charbroiled all-beef patty, filling out this bun pretty nicely, guys. Underneath it, we've got onions, we've got lettuce, we've got tomatoes and mayo. And that rounds up what this particular version is. Available in the single that we have here as well as a double the big angus variant with thicker beef as well as chicken so guys you have a multitude of ways to get into this one over here but for this wow. particular one this is looking pretty decent and i gotta say the aroma is smelling pretty nice definitely hawaiian in theme yeah so let's not waste any more time on this one let's see if the flavor delivers guys this is the teriyaki burger over here at carl's jr let's peep out this flavor Yep, so many different ways to enjoy this one, guys. Just choosing the type of protein in the middle is the only main difference. But as you can see, the grilled pineapple slice is looking pretty nicely there. And we've got a lot of teriyaki sauce to go with. Yeah. And let me just say, I'm glad I've got this burger diaper right now because my fingers are already sticky with this. So yeah. love this situation. It presents yeah. pretty well. Let's see how juicy this is going to be as well as flavorful with the sweetness, I'm thinking. Guys, this is the teriyaki burger over here at Carl's Jr. for summer 2024. Let's peep this out. Mm. Plenty of teriyaki sauce. Plenty. Oh, yeah. Hawaiian theme on deck. Sweetness of the pineapple. That's pretty nice. Definitely hearty. And just for the single version, too. Pretty good. Wow. And let me just say, aside from the burger diaper, I'm also thankful that the teriyaki sauce, which is plentiful on this one, is drowning out the flavor of the tomato. And it's not really a thick-cut piece of tomato, as you can see there, but still, it's there nonetheless. But with this one here, guys, I gotta say, it's definitely a showcase for the pineapple slice. The sweetness is definitely there. It's juicy. And then you have very sweet teriyaki sauce to go with. And, of course, the charbroiled action that you're seeing from the beef right over there. This is pretty nice, along with the crunch of the onions, as well as the lettuce on this one. Wow. And yeah, might as well get this out of the way already, guys, because you know the state of fast food these days. This is $8.99 for the single here in Southern Cali, but there is occasionally in this promo on the app that you can usually get 20% wow. off. So I recommend checking the app, and you actually may find that they're loaded for you there. It's not being advertised unless you click on the offers tab, and then you'll probably see it there. But guys, I'm glad I did that with this one. Still very tasty, even though the price is a little elevated for what it is. The sweetness is decent, as well as the flavor of the beef. It's Carl's Jr. You know, it's all good. So let's go for another bite. Right, wow. Mm. Beefy. And that pineapple slice is banging. Man, I gotta get to Hawaii. <laughs> well, I'm not tasting any of the melted Swiss on this one, guys, because obviously it's being drowned out by the teriyaki sauce, but it's definitely helping to hold everything in place, and that's usually the role of cheese when it comes to cheeseburgers in general. It would be nice to taste it, though, but I have to admit it is keeping everything together here. Pretty flavorful, nonetheless, though, for everything else on this one. Well, I hope you guys are digging my look at this particular one so far. And if you are, make sure to hit that thumbs up down below. And if you want to drop a super thanks, you'll probably see that down there as well, too, guys. Because I definitely have a lot of fun putting my stuff together for you. And this is no exception. Wow. A very tasty situation with this one here as well. Let's go for a few more bites on it. I bet it is tasty. And wow. Mm. I bet it is tasty. Now, as good as the wow. onions are on this, I think red onions would have gone a long way. Maybe some pickles, too, to kind of change it up just a little bit. Given how vibrant the teriyaki sauce is on this, I don't think that would have conflicted too much, but it's tasty for what it is, for sure. 
So yeah, pretty tasty situation with this one. And even though the meat itself is just a single variant, going with the double is going to make it that much of a beefier situation for you. Especially the Big Angus, a.k.a. the old $6 burger from back then. That would have been nice as well, too. And of right. course, you've got chicken to go in on. So guys, a multitude of ways to enjoy this one. And the flavor is pretty decent. If you like pineapple and teriyaki sauce, you're going to get a total Hawaiian vibe with this particular one, as I am right now. So let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap the review with the rating coming up next. But a tasty situation. A little on the high side in terms of pricing, but that's the state of the world we live in these days. Let's go for another bite and we'll finish this one out. Hang on. Yeah. Mm. Well, it's definitely got that summertime vibe, guys. This really is suited pretty nicely for the June-July time frame. And I got to say, the overall flavor is pretty nice on it. The sweetness of the teriyaki sauce along with the pineapple slice. A lovely situation because it's grilled, it's juicy, and it goes very nicely yeah. with the all-beef goodness over here at Carl's Jr. Along wow. with all the crunchy action to go with as well. Wow. This is something wow. definitely to check out. Wow. So with that said, I'm going to have to give the teriyaki burger, the single version over here at Carl's Jr., a pretty decent 8.3 out of 10. Guys, it's wow. definitely a tasty situation, even though the price is a little bit up there for what it is. But like I said, it does deliver in terms of the flavor. That grilled pineapple slice is a major highlight, as you'd expect it to be. And there's plenty of sweet teriyaki sauce. And I got to say, I'm glad again for that burger diaper. Make sure you've got plenty of napkins on hand just in case. It is something to check out. And it's perfectly suited for summer 2024. I think you'd probably agree with that, right? Yeah. All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. Confirm that for me. Let me know if you think this is perfectly suited for summertime. And naturally, if you've given it a go, which version did you get and how much did you pay for it? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is ENK closing out another high-quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow, and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I could Sorry, I had an itch right there. Sorry about that, everybody. I do it without you, and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do, and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did yeah. before this one, yeah, you yeah. can find it right up yeah. over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up. And sorry for mumbling to myself. Sorry about that, everybody. My bad. And let me take care of this notification. I'll be right back, everybody. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, everybody. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my channel or to Peep This Out's channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post. And share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my channel, we are on the road to 9,000 subscribers. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my channel. By taking a look at my other videos that are on the three playlists that are on my channel. And give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too. Please everybody, I would really appreciate it. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my channel as well. Also, please everybody, I would really definitely appreciate that too. And please help me accomplish my goal to get 9,000 subscribers or more on my channel as well. Also, please everybody, I would really definitely appreciate it. And the link to Peep This Out's original video will be down in the description down below. I just thought I'd let everybody know about that. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya!